All right, guys. I want to do a little filming vlog because I've always liked to look back on memories. You tried Nacho with Jacob. The heroin got him. I don't have nothing to say. He grew a mustache and had a flannel and a bullet. He tried to tell us. Oh, good boy. Welcome back, guys, to the Odd Pop Podcast. We appreciate all four of you visiting. We went down a number. I don't know if I'm doing the intro or not, but here it is. Andy, what do you have to say about last episode? Gosh, I was so excited. It was There was so much synergy going on. Right. Uh, I'm really proud of the team for pulling together and, 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 and taking that one home. Um, right. Uh, there's a lot of great things this team's working on. I can't wait to show you. Right, right, right. Jacob? Uh, Thanks, so, Jacob. So now we're going to talk about the events of the year. And we're going to start with um, one thing that I have. So I'll start first. <laughs> we're not going to go back. What? Okay, never mind. Everyone talked. Uh, yeah, I said something. Yeah. You did say something. <laughs> I got it in there. The views go up when I make fun of you. See, Gorn doesn't like it either. He thinks it's he thinks it's rude. Aliens. Real. Isn't it crazy how the government admitted this year that aliens were real and basically none of us said anything? Because we already knew that aliens existed. It's but we. Like... It was just a whistleblower, though, right? Yeah. Or, no, it was a guy who knew a guy that said they were real. He had been in the government for a while. But but he wasn't the person that was on that project. Still. No, not still. He talked to people familiar with the matter. They're not, those, the people that are familiar with the matter aren't even supposed to talk about the matter. Yeah, but they were familiar with the not about to be spoken about matter. I, I don't buy it. I just liked how there was aliens. Dude, alien, I believe in aliens. I think, I think there are things out there, right? So I believe in aliens, but I don't think they're green little men. Are you talking about what Mexico uncovered? That was funny as shit. Did you watch like, that? Those little, no. little people. Oh, you didn't show see that? A picture. So, I can show for you. Let me look it up. So, show me a picture. So, guys, roughly one week later, this is gonna blow every fan's mind. So, yeah, this is it. They released. They this showed the same this week. in front of like they announced it on their. Um, this was the government broadcast, yeah. whatever their big news station. Right here, they announced this on their government broadcast. This is literally like like someone <laughs> killed ET and left him in a box. They had two of them too. It was that was one, that too. You didn't see the memes going around of this other no, no, It was like that meme it. with the alien that would do the drugs. So that was my event of the year. Because I believe in aliens, mm -hmm. and the fact that the government pretty much was like, yeah, there are aliens. And he they were like, did you see any human remains? And they were like, there were organic remains, but not of this world. And it's like, I make a look back. What event was going on during that time? There was, there was one big news media cycle that was going on during that. I think it was one of the fires. It was one of the mm, fires that we've had. Canada's fire. It might have been Canada's fire because that's when we were smelling the smoke. Yep. I remember oh, yeah. That. that was annoying. That was very that was annoying. Very bad. I was like, this is ruining my vaping. Yeah, well, you could have just got outside and naturally yeah. did it. Dude. I, I couldn't God's exercise way. outside for that whole like three-week period. It was right. kind of crazy. It was crazy. It was crazy. I could not exercise because you wanted to exercise yeah. in the middle of august at like 95 degrees that's yeah. the only way you do and you couldn't i just did naturally yeah period period what's your event of the year since that. you've been frantically looking there is not since there. i've started talking i don't have something look, to I talk about anything, right? i have something okay tell your me. event of the year the cyber truck actually made its way out of, of um wherever the fuck elon brings them out of yeah yeah that's a big one cyber truck how many years three since something he announced like it that. yeah Three years. A long ass time. Would you get one? Fuck no. Why? You're so ugly. I don't. And that's why he's crazy. If we have a Elon Musk crazy counter. Because the car is ugly. What? Are you saying he's crazy because the car is ugly? So I think that no. Why are you saying he's crazy? Well, he talked about it being unique. It's like bulletproof and stuff, which I thought was really cool. So what makes him crazy? Though? That's what I'm wondering. Why are you? Why is your dick so hard for him? You're like I'm trying just to wondering what back. you were saying. You said there's a counter. Why is he crazy? Because who makes a cyber truck like that? Oh, so it's because of how it looks. Yeah. 
Okay, okay, so God's crazy because he made you look like that. No, because God's not real, so that's irrelevant. Oh, holy shit. All right, but hang on. Maybe we can't agree on Elon's, how hard Elon's cock is. But maybe we can agree about is that Google? who would win, Mark Zuckerberg or Elon Musk. That's a good topic. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg. Mark, Mark Zuckerberg, Zuckerberg? I agree with sure, that. Yeah. Me too. Okay, unanimous. Okay, look at that. We all agree. I've also never seen Elon fight before. I've only seen Mark in some clips. That's crazy how, how fast you're just going to drop Elon like that. Have you seen the before and after photos of Elon Musk before he was rich and then after he was rich? He got fat. No. He, like, grew a jawline. What? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Money can do that magically. I notice yeah. that happens when people are oh, rich. and hair. No. How did he look like before? Yo, what? I think he just did surgery. He definitely did surgery. That's crazy how they can give you your hair back. You know that you can get knee surgery now? Where they make you taller? What? what? People are doing that right now. I don't know if it's knee or shins, but they're making it's, taller. It's the shins, yeah. Shins. I remember, or or maybe, maybe it was the femur. I think I I heard someone talking about it, and they were like, oh, "No, I'm not gonna do that fucking surgery." Cause what, you show up three inches taller the next day? There's, there's just no way you hide that. You'd be like, "I'm you like, gotta that. talk about it." I got money. You got money. I don't Apparently. know how much it would cost, but like, in your your you can't walk for a while too. You gotta relearn. What do they do though? Because I know in a lot of surgeries they take like a piece of your body and put it somewhere else. Like, where do they get the extra shin from? No, I don't. I don't know what they do really. I well, look it up, Jamie. It. Okay. Um, I think they turn you into a RoboCop, right? Oh, they're. I feel like they just put more metal in you. Yeah. What to expect? On the seventh floor. What to expect? Taller, hopefully. Oh, so this is at the pen. Musculoskeletal Center, University City, on the seventh floor. You just go in. What's the phone number? <laughs> you want to call I'm him? Call him. I'm you dead ass. I'm five two right now. Can you? I'm gonna me? call him. Dead ass. What's the phone number? Um, I don't. I don't have a number. Can we have a? Can we have a? I mean, can oh, we have yeah. a ridiculous? To schedule your consultation, please call two one five. Hold on, hold on. Uh, don't say the number. Mute, mute all of this. And I'm gonna meet every time we set the company. What is your plan? Where do you want to say that? Hey, I'm short as fuck. And then, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna ask him for fucking legs. So, hip replacement. I'm so sorry, dude. I'm so sorry. Come here. Shh, shh, it's okay. It's okay. You didn't like it. I know you didn't like it. I know you didn't. Unfair. I have the. Megan Wilson is not available. Record your message after. She's probably hot. She sounds like a baddie, huh? A magnet. A magnetic lengthening rod and pins are inserted into the bone, which allows the leg to have controlled lengthening over a period of time. There is an external magnet that it, that that is applied over the lengthening device, which magnetizes a gear in the device and moves the telescoping rod. I've seen a video, they literally have this thing on your leg and then like, and it's like, Ooh. You know, it apparently has to do with magnets. Um, Wait, what was the number again? I might have called the wrong number. I have another question if we want. Oh wait, no, we had you. No, you already said cyber trucks. You said I already got it right. Well, we were talking about the men of the year. So his was cyber truck. Mine was aliens. I can't think of it. I can go through my photos, but I can't was there a time that made you like really sad this year? It's been a great year, Dad. I can't think of it. I'm thinking of something great. What was something happiest? exciting? Was, was was moving in with your girlfriend? That was this year, wasn't it? That was this year. That was so exciting. I'm proud of you. I had surgery this year. Oh. Did they fix you? I went to, they couldn't. I said, can you guys just put it back to how it was? <laughs> <laughs> can you imagine, like, asking to get, like, your, I don't know, your pinky amputated and they take the wrong fucking pinky? Oh, God. <laughs> Why would you want your pinky amputated? I don't know. Like, like that happens, right? <laughs> when, when they do amputations, they have to, like, write all over the part of your body that they're going to amputate. Because imagine you wake up because you need to get something taken off and take the wrong fucking one. So now you're you're gimpy over here with no fucking arms. Yeah, they mark it. Uh, yeah. Do y'all... Just like that. Do y'all want to hear something wild? So I heard this story of this lady. And I don't know if there's a language barrier because the person can't, like, speak Spanish very well. Or can't speak English very well. But, like, you know, they need a surgery because they're, um... They had a kidney stone or something? I forgot what they had. They had something that needed to be removed. No, they're, um... 
They had a kidney stone. They had a kidney stone. So they need a kidney stone removed. So they were getting their kidney stone removed. She gets it removed. And this person is sitting there and they're like, yeah, we got the kidney stone. Also, we took out your pancreas. And this person was like, what? And they were like, yeah, we took that out as well since we were like in that area. Yeah, and that's messed up. they were like, well, it's a surgery. I don't feel like you could just do that. And apparently they had like papers, but... I don't know, I was like, it might have been the language barrier. I'm not sure, but I was like, look, you need your pancreas removed regardless. No, not your pancreas. It was, um... Impede what, it's called the impedex? The, oh, shit. I know what you're talking about. Appendix, appendix. 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 Yeah, they were yeah, like, also removed your, your appendix. Yeah. And uh, they were like, all right, well, like, I know that needs to get removed at some point, but the fact that you did it without telling me, I don't know, what are your thoughts on that? Uh, Getting I something removed that you need to remove at some point, but they didn't tell you. If they didn't tell me, I'd be pissed. But if you think about it, right? Let's buy one, get one free. Yeah. Let's buy one, get one free. That's what I'm saying. Like, you need that removed at some point. If not, just a, potentially a ticking time bomb for some people. I had a, a appendix scare. I remember that. Yeah. Really? Yeah. How long ago? We're going to have to wait for his biography Summer? episode. <laughs> See, everybody I'm ready for has it. a story. I'm ready for it. <laughs> okay. We're going to need three hours. <laughs> I'm ready for it. I'm gonna make that a full nacho documentary. But that's um, memory cards. <laughs> <laughs> Not enough SD cards for that. But yeah, that's my um whatever we were talking about with surgery. Yeah, I have a random yeah. question. Okay. You may have heard of it already, and I'm gonna shout this other podcast out because I heard it from them, the Picky Boys podcast. I actually watched one of their things today. They were kind of good. Um, and they're getting views right now. Um, anyways, here's a question. How many owls would you have to see in a singular day before you start questioning if something's seriously wrong? Are owls a bad omen? That's actually crazy. Like, how many would how you many? have to see to be like, okay, something's not right? Yeah. Three. Three? Three? Isn't that a low amount? I want to agree with you, but I actually don't think I would... Because what, what are you going to do? Say you saw three, what are you going to do? I'm going to be Still like... Still question it? Where the fuck are all the Tootsie Pops? <laughs> they gave <laughs> up on that, huh? That? Man, they must have given up, yeah. huh? Exactly. But like, okay, say, so three is your answer. What if you saw six? That's what my number. Doing? That's my number. I'm going to try to catch six? one. Six? And I'm six not talking the same area throughout your day. Yeah. Like six or ten, if I just see them. Because I've seen maybe six two ten. max. <laughs> I've seen maybe two max, like on a drive. Mm -hmm. But if I see ten, I'm like, what the fuck are all these owls coming from? Like what's happening? But what are you doing? You're catching them. You're you, would, you would try to get one, them? right? Yeah. And, and keeping it as a pet. That would be so fucking cool. I wouldn't keep one. You wouldn't, like, if you saw six, the sixth one, you'd be like, all right, something's wrong. Let me go talk to this owl. Start communicating. So, <laughs> it's, it's 523. <laughs> it's like that Rick and Morty scene, like, you go up to the owl and you look at it, and it's like, the kid's looking at us. Who cares? It's just a stupid kid. No, he's looking at us like he understands us. Come and then they're like, boy. yeah, come here, little boy. The owl starts chasing you. It's their revolution. Is Rick and Morty worth watching? Absolutely. Yeah. Have you ever I seen it? I haven't seen that new season. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, dude, it's it's good. Yeah. Yeah, the first couple seasons are fucking legendary. I, I think my answer would be four, and then yeah, I'd go up to the owls, and, or a owl, the like, fourth owl I see, and try to talk to it or something, and be like, what's going on here? At what point <laughs> do you see owls where you feel like you want to like, just tell a friend or text it? Like, you know you're talking to If I see an owl, I'm telling Meg. Hey, I just saw an owl today. Like, cause wow. I, or a bald eagle. If I see a bald cool. eagle on text, have you ever seen a white white squirrel? All white squirrel. No. With red eyes? No. There's a white squirrel. I think oh, there wow. are albino squirrels. Yeah. yeah. I, I saw one. Where? Oh, I forget what city. It might have been Reston. Did you get a picture? Yeah. Yeah. I like this. I like this segment actually. Rarest squirrel sightings. I have one. Andy has one. My rarest squirrel sighting. I saw a squirrel with a gold tail. Fully gray. Okay. It had a clip or something though, mm -hmm. like on the tail part, yeah. and the tail was gold. But I was driving, and it made me think that squirrel lose his tail. They sewed it back on, and I guess I don't know. It just got the fur dyed or something. Mm -hmm. Or did the squirrel lose his tail, and someone thought let's just clip another one on there because <laughs> the tail there was a clip, like a visible clip. But the squirrel, it was like a gray squirrel, and the tail was gold. But I remember freaking, oh my squirrel with a gold tail. That's crazy. Yeah. That is crazy. What was yours? All the albino squirrel. Albino squirrel, albino yeah. squirrel, yeah. You must have looked at that and thought, you're damn right. Oh, yeah, I took a video of that and sent it to me. Wait, Some you never sent me this? When did you see this? That was a long time ago. I didn't know you then. All right. I was peeking. Okay. 
You? Um, I don't have a rare squirrel sighting, but one time mm, there was a family of squirrels in my parents' attic, and um, we, we caught one of the babies, and for like three days I just lived with this baby squirrel. That was so cute. You sent a picture of it. I did. It was really cute. That's awesome. <laughs> we both did this at the same time. <laughs> We're starting to get in content. That was a really, you sent a picture of a squirrel, and then you got roasted for it for not texting a friend back. Because you could pay attention to a yeah, squirrel. Yeah, someone got, someone got very upset because instead of, was it texting back? Yeah. Instead of texting him back, I was playing with a squirrel. A baby squirrel. That's fair. Is that not fair? I mean, you're kind of gay. I thought it was quite fair. Yeah. That was, un that was But at the end of the game, it wasn't that deep. Bros before squirrels. Bros before squirrels. 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 Okay. Squirrels. Okay, I have uh, the last topic of the night. All right. All right. Last topic. We're going to start with Nacho. Why are you going to jail? Oh, this and and this, had, this, this had me thinking because I was driving the day and someone almost ran to me and I got really unreasonably angry. <clears throat> and I was in Maryland because Maryland drivers are the worst drivers. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to jail for road rage. That is why I'm going to jail. For well, that's the something that you could like go to jail for. Disturbing the peace. Mine was for like fighting somebody or disturbing the peace. Fighting someone. Oh, okay. Or like running someone off the road for road rage. Okay. okay. That is why I'm going to jail. Okay, that's fair. Treason. You can't say that. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Treason okay. against uh, who? Uh, my boys, the boys, the homies. Okay. Yo, my homies. No, I wouldn't go to jail. Go to jail. jail. No, no, okay. no, no, no. I, I would go to jail for probably fighting somebody. Fighting somebody? I've never fought somebody before, like, ever. And since I've never fought anybody, bro, there's just, like, so much anger in me, bro. Like, the first person that makes me mad, I swear, like, dog, like, they're gonna get like it. Swain. Swain. Okay. And I've done no Muay Thai. Okay. I'm not buying that for a second. What? That I haven't done Muay Thai because I'm that good? I know. You can couple with a better reason. Alright, cut. You're going to jail? A fight. Generally, a fight. No, it would not be a fight. Why? Because it's not gonna happen. Yeah. You mean you are look? You, are you huh? saying that he's too much of a pussy to get in a fight? I've never seen you act aggressive towards another person, and I also know you don't like going in uncomfortable situations. I don't. Or putting yourself in uncomfortable. You situations. You think so low of me that you're like That's no? Not, not even in your imagination can you say you'd get in a fight. I thought we were being realistic. Not he not. had a life example. It happened recently. He said, I could see myself doing some stupid right now, and then it could end me up in jail, and that's probably why you decided against it. Petty theft. Fine. Yeah. <laughs> Petty theft. You steal the newest box of Yu-Gi-Oh cards? Yeah. I'll get caught stealing some detergent or something. I don't know. <laughs> shampoo. <laughs> Head and shoulders shampoo. That's right. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> There, you want it? Okay. I don't fight. Petty theft. <laughs> Petty theft. I got greedy and took some gum and fucking got jailed. Mm. And then deported. Mm. <laughs> for your crime. I was trying to think, what would I go to jail for? Um. You not paying your taxes? I what I was going to say. Are you beating Meg? Uh, <laughs> domestic, yeah. 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 You stealing yeah. catalytic converters? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Hacking? I can't think of this. Hacking? I like that. Hacking, uh, yeah. 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 I guess yeah. I don't have anything. You're not well, going to jail. I guess I'm not going to okay, jail. Okay, okay, let's okay, let's let's make it up to us. And why is Jacob going to jail? That's fair. Jacob's going to jail because he committed a hate crime. Hmm. Can I do nacho now? <laughs> okay. No, 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 I didn't do oh, what? Oh, I didn't do what? I didn't do what? Okay. He did it again because he didn't learn his lesson. Two hate crimes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, Jacob. You want to go first or me? Mm, you first, you first. Nacho starts up as a bartender and takes home an <laughs> underage girl on accident because she had a fake. Can you say that louder, please? <laughs> Nacho starts as a bartender again and Fernandez. takes home a underage girl on accident because she had a fake. Well, that's... She's the one breaking the crime. I'm the victim. Yep. 
that's, I don't know what the law <laughs> says in that scenario. I have my laptop down, I can't pick it up. Why would you give me, why would you give me more work than I have? I got two hate crimes! But do you realize how deep I have to, do you realize yeah. how deep I have to Like, watch I didn't learn the first time, like, I got a second one? Are you and that crazy? says something about your character. Yeah, I was confused on the pass I got, so. Technically, I already committed one. I don't know what you're talking about. Neither do I. I, I genuinely don't. You're well, right. We could dive into that later. Uh, why is Nacho going to jail? Well, when is this podcast coming out? A week from now, right? Yeah. Yeah, I've committed one. I don't know what you're wanking for. Because if this comes out a week from now, I will have committed a crime by then. Oh, uh, okay. Will you be in jail? I'll bail you out. I don't know if you probably are going to be available that day to bail me out. Am I going to be in jail as well? You won't be available. I don't know what this means. I'm so lost. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay. I won't be there. Why would Andy be in jail? I've bailed somebody out of jail already. Really? I know the gist. What yes. did Meg do? Why is it always Meg? I have done this. I've been through it. Oh, wait, wait. I actually... Not I. Was, it, you, was it your now. money that have you, you bailed You told me this one time. I don't want to say the name. I don't even remember the name. Back. I'm just a great person. Yeah. How much was it? 10000 I believe. Oh my god. Bales Bond is not cheap. But Wasn't I could also be wrong because I split it with somebody else. Wasn't it far away too because you had to actually go there? No, it's Fairfax County one. Did but you where were you? Me? Weren't you in Gainesville or something Central. at the time? Center of the car. Yeah. But wow. he's done. I mean, dude, a homie that's willing to bail you out of jail. Honestly, I, got off I love that shit. And I went and did it immediately. Because I was like, he, he wrote down his my fucking number on his uh, hand and everything. I, don't, I couldn't say he'd do that for me, though. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Jacob, you're a good friend. Though. Come on, guys. Let's give it up for Jacob. I I only know your number. Well, no, I know yours, John's, and... No, I know yours and Joseph's. John's is 37, 33? 36, 33? I only know my father's. Say it. And, and my brother's. Both my brother's. But I wouldn't call them. I would call my father. Do you know Meg's? No. Really? Mm -hmm. I didn't memorize my girlfriend's number either. My ex's at the time. She'd give me so much shit for it, and I'm like, I just don't know, it's just not registering. Yeah, dude, I memorized everybody's when I was younger. Same. I don't know why I haven't taken that time out of my life to try to memorize again, but... Is it because those phones weren't yours? Just no need to memorize numbers. Yeah, anymore. it's all on... Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like, I knew my neighbor's phone number. I have. I still have all of that up in my head. Really? Yeah. I remember, like, childhood friends, like, their house phone numbers, too. Yeah? Remember, yeah. Mm. A lot of them. Hey, guys, we didn't... I don't... Do you know we don't know why I'm going to jail yet, so it's just waiting. For yeah, you said it already. Oh, I mean, from you us? Had to guess. Oh, oh, oh. You plowed into a parade of like 30 people, and then you were like, Why'd they take a bro? I do taxi! I do taxi! I bet bro here! What do you think the reason is? A kid grabs your rock while you're up on a wall and you kick him down. Ooh, that one is actually more oh. believable! <laughs> that that one's more believable! For, for ref. For context, he's talking about rock climbing. Yeah. I do think about that. I think about, like, if there was just a kid below me while I was climbing, if I just let go, like, what my repercussions would be. I, I feel like that has to be somewhere in the signing when you signed up. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. It's not so my So I'm fault. talking about you purposely kicking off. Like, stop touching my shit. And you kick them off. Imagine you're just climbing and you're like... <laughs> <laughs> you can kick him where you're just climbing, he's below you, and you're like... Whoa! You just fall back and smash them. Well, everyone looks at you then. Would you do it bouldering? What if you push somebody? You get in big trouble. Hmm? Well, I don't know. Everyone signs a waiver, so maybe maybe you can just hurt people you, in the rock climbing gym. That's what I'm saying. Free for all out what does that waiver say? Dark. I don't know. I don't read. I don't read waivers. Terms of use. I knew somebody that actually read terms of use stuff. Oh. That was like a job. Time Magazine Person of the Year throughout the year starting in 1999 through 2023. Right, and I'm gonna just start. I'm gonna start listing people, and you guys react how you want to react. Okay. 1991 or 1999, sorry, Jeff Bezos. Wow. 2000, no George Bush. Oh, what? 2003, the American Soldier. Makes sense. That makes sense. I can respect that. I get that. Okay, I understand that. Did we skip two years? 2007. Yeah, we're just we're skimming by, right? 2007, Vladimir Putin. When? Oh. When? 2007. That's when George W. Bush said, I looked at him and I saw the soul of a kind man. Mm. George W. Bush said that. Okay. 2008, Barack Obama. Yep. 2010, Mark Zuckerberg. That's that's in the movie also dropped too, right? 
No, I think the movie came out later. Okay. Oh, The Social Network? Yeah. 2012, Barack Obama again. <laughs> and then, hey, if you get it, if you're a two timer. Okay. Okay. Great president. 2016, Donald Trump. Yeah, I remember that one. Little horns. 2021. Hey. Cool. You ready for this one? 2021, 2021, Elon Musk. Alright, and who do we think this year is? I, I said know. all of those important people, right? You would agree most of them, if not all of them, are super important. Mm -hmm. uh, they have all changed this. the world one way or another and impacted for the end of this time. I will say this. That's what Time Magazine says. Describes its choices as influence and importance. Were, um, were they in the news cycle a lot this year? Yes. I'll give you a hand. No, dig deep. He knows this. You know There's this. There's a reason I'm mentioning it right now. You know this. Time Magazine, 2023 Andy. person of the year is. It's not you, but who is it? Max Verstappen. Mm. Uh, that's a good guess. That is not a good not guess. Show? 21, uh, 2023 person of the year is Taylor Swift. Wow. That's. That's a perfect segue. Into <laughs> Taylor Swift being the third woman ever to become person of the year in Time Magazine behind Greta Thornburg or Thunberg and in 2019 oh 2020 was Kamala Harris and uh, Joe Biden they did a team match. Kamala? 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 Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris. Yeah. Her. Cancel him. Her. She bad. Anyway so we're going to move on from that. Now Taylor Swift let's talk about it. 2023 She's up there with the American Soldier, apparently. You know, um, when, you, when you when you put it like that, <laughs> who who made the real sacrifice? Talk to me. <laughs> She's up what there. are your thoughts on that? Did you see the picture? I, I honestly, that's crazy. Let me show you the picture. Is she like the first singer in time? Yes, actually, that's another that? thing. The first artist, actually? artist, receiving person of the year. I couldn't, I mean, there's probably other artists up there. I just can't name it off the top of my head. I just mean, should get it. Did she do a lot of philanthropy? I feel like that's the only other guess I could give besides. She dates average dudes, like looking dudes. Is that that's okay. that's charity work. Travis Kelsey, right? I mean, <laughs> mul mullet boy, Travis Kelsey. Come on. She, um, uh, I don't know. This is the picture. With a cat. Interesting. She posted on Instagram and it's like time person of the year asks me, Okay. Do you want to take a picture? Can I bring my cat? <clears throat> she loves her cats. Me too. But I don't love her. Well, that's a perfect segue into our next segment. Why are you doing that? What's the next segment? What's, What's the next segment? You guys segment? are gonna talk where, about your songs. Where he, where the, the songs. Oh yeah. So sorry, he's not <clears throat> with it. Have you watched Taylor Swift before? Have I watched Taylor Swift? Or have you Swift seen before? her before? <laughs> have you seen her before? <laughs> yes, I know. What's your favorite you. songs? We talk about her. Me? I'm pulling up songs right now. One song that I liked by her came out as like, Never, ever, ever getting back together. We! Yeah, I liked that classic. one. I don't know what it's called though. Back Together? We. I didn't like that one. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't like that one? I no. like that one. That one was a good one. We we are never getting back together. We are never getting back together. Yeah, that's, that's a good one. Name. That's when she started going like dubstepy in her songs and shit. Oh, if you want, everyone yeah. started doing that around that time. All right, yeah, JB was doing that for sure. Ooh, Justin Bieber did it right. Yeah, that's, see, I yeah. love Justin Bieber. Oh, okay. uh, Justin Bieber. <laughs> oh, big jump! I thought it was Jessica coming down. I was about to say, come sit with us, Jessica. I have another, I mean, if you guys are going to do your thing, or I, I have something else that also goes... Go for it. You sure? You don't well, want I was going to play a song. song. I was going to play a song. No, we can go back to that later. Which well, damn I, song. I mean, what, what it, do you, you guys want to do with that? I got a song. All right. I want to play it. And pull it. You, you have yours up? Yeah. Pull it up. Uh, I feel like... We should, How are we going to do the show? We should have given him headphones so he can listen to it. Yeah, because I can't have the music playing. I mean, I could. Get the montage real quick. Fuck, this is an awful idea. God damn it. Move it on? No. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna play it. Let's get demonetized. 
Shadow ban, demonetize. Just don't give me my don't give me your thoughts until you. afterwards. Huh? The first. Don't give me your thoughts until afterwards. You're gonna play the whole song. What? You're gonna play the whole song? No. Because I thought we had something going on. No, you're just another <laughs> foot, bro. <laughs> okay. You're just another foot. <laughs> Wait, are you raw dogging it? Yeah, you are. Watch, I'm proud of you. For not I am dogging. so sorry. It didn't mark. It didn't mark. It didn't mark. It didn't mark. You're very reckless with my walls. I am. I'm. And I didn't want to say it earlier, but now I'm going to say it because it's on film. I try not to be. Are we filming right now? I get it. This is why he's going to go to jail because he's going to beat the shit out of you. Because you because you marked my walls and I stabbed you on your way out. I think cheap for you, (laughs) senor. (laughs) Okay. Well, everyone, thank you so much for tuning into the Odd Pod podcast today. I hope to catch you guys next time. I thought it was Jacob that was going to do it. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And a happy new year. And a happy new year, everybody. This was supposed to be a Christmas episode, but it didn't work out. Ho, ho, ho. Do you want to do the thumbnail now? Wait. Here's a picture of me as Santa Claus. Fucking asshole. All right, thumbnail. Here's a picture of of Andy. Here's a picture of a dog. Here's a picture of a cat. No one's going to see this, and I'll probably get lazy by the time I get to this part. I have a picture of Professor as Santa Claus. And that's it.